In the silence of dawn, six B-2 spirits move along the runway. Today, they embark on one of the most critical secret missions in history. Inside the U.S. Strategic Command Center, final decisions are being made. Every second and every route is carefully calculated. The long journey of the bomber is only possible with tankers. Midair, a B-2 spirit receives vital fuel from a KC-135. The Growler Squadron protects both tankers and bombers. Their mission, ensure stealth and disrupt enemy radar. From beneath the sea, a nuclear submarine launches 30 Tomahawk missiles, each targeting Iran's underground nuclear sites. High above the desert mountains, the stealth bomber advances silently, hidden from enemy eyes. Iran's defense systems awaken. Radar screens glow as the silhouette of incoming aircraft appears. The Growler Squadron emits electronic jamming, disrupting enemy radar and communications. The bomb bay doors open. Inside rest the massive GBU-57 bunker buster bombs, ready for deployment. From 50,000 feet above, the GBU-57, the world's most powerful penetrator bomb, plummets earthward. It penetrates 200 feet underground, detonating with immense force to shatter hardened bunkers. At an Iranian airbase, old fighters rush to scramble, racing skyward to intercept. AWACS aircraft guides FA-18s, tracking all enemy movements on radar. A fierce dogfight erupts as FA-18 launch long-range missiles at incoming fighters. In panic, Iranian SAM sites fire missiles blindly into the night sky. Mission complete. The B-2 squadron retreats under the protection of raptors, leaving behind smoke and ruins. Satellite images reveal the nuclear sites devastated. Nothing remains as before. Inside the Pentagon, generals analyze the strike's impact and its effect on future defense. Around the world, media storm with questions. Who did it? Why and what damage was done? This was not just a strike. It was a demonstration of modern warfare's precision and technology.